What's going on guys? I am back with another wrestling video. Uh, I haven't been making videos. There hasn't been much news, but there is news certainly today. came out last week, most of the news. And we're going to get plenty of news too because next week is Bash in Berlin. WWE Bash in Berlin and NXT No Mercy. So we're going to start with this. Randy Orton reportedly agreed to a new long-term contract with WWE. So this contract expires in 2029. And he will be a world champion again. You'll see Randy Orton as world champion again. And at Bash in Berlin, it is official. And I called I called this. CM Punk versus Drew McIntyre in a strap match. And this is the, the old school uh, strap match where you got to uh, touch all turnbuckles, all four turnbuckles to win. Can't wait for that. Uh, and, oh, they're teasing it, and this is fantastic. So this past Monday, we had the New Day, Xavier Woods, Kofi Kingston, Odyssey Jones versus The Final Testament, Karrion Cross, and AOP, Authors of Pain. Kofi made the tag to Odyssey Jones. It was like a hot tag. Xavier Woods did not like it, and they're teasing it. So this heel turn is coming. For Xavier Woods. I can't wait for Xavier Woods' heel turn. It's going to be fantastic. It's going to be so good when he turns on Kofi and Odyssey Jones. Now this coming Monday. Uncle Howdy. Bo Dallas. Versus Chad Gable. Um, I do think Uncle Howdy is going to win. Bo Dallas is going to defeat Chad Gable. I don't know if the whole Wyatt Six is going to get involved though. But... Uncle Howdy's going to win. He's going to defeat Chad Gable. <clears throat> and on NXT, uh, Joe Hendry, my man. Joe Hendry, I believe in Joe Hendry. He defeated Wesley and Pete Dunn. So Joe Hendry will face Ethan Page at no mercy for the NXT World Champion. I think Ethan Page is going to retain, but I want Joe Hendry to win so bad. But Ethan Page is going to retain. I love Ethan Page. <clears throat> also, at No Mercy, like I just said, we have Ethan Page versus Joe Hendry. <clears throat> For the NXT World Champion, I'm picking Joe Hendry. Opa Femi versus Tony D'Angelo for the NXT North American Champion. That's tough. I think Opa Femi. Opa Femi is going to retain, I think. Then we got the rematch between Nathan Frazier, Axiom, and Chase U, Rich Holland, and Andre, uh, Andre Chase. Andre Chase and Rich Holland are going to retain their NXT tag titles. Um, And this, uh, this past Friday, yet yeah, last night, actually. Kevin Owens, do I think he's going to do like a heel turn? Because they're teasing it. Kevin Owens is going to be a heel. I think it's going to happen. I think at Basham Berlin, Cody's going to win after the match. Cody's going to be like, like, Kevin Owens, great match, great match. Then Kevin Owens is going to kick him in the balls. I think Kevin Owens is doing it. He's going to uh, low blow, low blow to Cody. Kevin Owens is going to be a major heel. But don't forget, we got Randy Orton. Randy Orton after Gunther, he's gonna come after Cody. <clears throat> Randy's gonna like he's gonna be like, Why you gave Kevin Owens a title match? Where's my title match, bitch? RKO to Cody Rhodes. Randy's gonna be I think we're gonna have two major heels. I think Kevin Owens is gonna turn on Cody at Bash from Berlin. Then Randy Orton is gonna turn on Cody Rhodes. So Cody's gonna have two major heels coming after him. Well Ke yeah, Cody's going to defeat Kevin Owens. Kevin Owens is not winning. Then that major feud's coming too between Randy and Cody. Can't wait. Um, Then the bloodline, which is very interesting. This is getting awesome. So Solo Sokoa, Tama Tonga, Tonga Loa, and Jacob Fatu. They all made their way to the ring. Solo Sokoa was like, Washington, D.C. Acknowledge me. Then the the whole crowd booed him. Then he looked at Tamatanga. He's like, 
we need to do something with these tag champs. Something's not right. Then Solo Sokova was like, Jacob Fatu, step up. So he stepped up. Then he told Jacob Fatu, you know what? Give your uh, SmackDown uh, tag champ to Tangaloa. Gave it to Tangaloa. And uh, Jacob Fatu is a new enforcer for Solo, which this is interesting. What I think is going to happen because Solo announced he's going to have a rematch with Cody Rhodes for the WWE Championship. Then, don't forget, Solo's going to be fighting Roman Reigns, maybe at Bad Blood. Solo's not winning. What I think, when Solo loses, he's going to have to acknowledge Roman Reigns, that he's the tribal chief. Jacob Fatu, Tama Tonga, Tango Lo are not going to do that. They're going to be like, what a freaking schmuck Solo Sokoa is. Jacob Fatu turns on Solo... Jago Fatu, Tama Tango, Tango Lo beat the living shit out of Solo Sokoa. Then Solo is going to be coming back to Roman Reigns, the Usos. That's when Hukuleo comes in. Hukuleo will be the newest member of the bloodline. So it will be Jago Fatu as the leader, Tama Tango, Tango Loa, and Hukuleo. And they trademark Tala Tonga. So Tala Tonga is going to be Hukuleo. So that, mark my words, that is what's going to happen. That's what's going to happen. And I can't freaking wait for it because this, oh my God, it's amazing. And that's all the wrestling news, but I got some shows and movies to talk about. So this got announced a couple days ago. Moon Knight, Marvel Moon Knight Season 2 is reportedly in the works at Marvel. Fantastic. I love that show. That show is amazing. Moon Knight's amazing. I can't wait. So it's, yeah, it's in development at Marvel Studios. Uh, Oscar Isaac will be the same uh, Moon Knight. So he's playing Moon Knight. That guy Isaac, I don't know how to say his name. But he's playing Moon Knight again. <clears throat> Insidious 6 is scheduled for release in theaters on August 29th, 2025. Alright, I'll give it a shot. I'll watch it. This is, I don't know if it's the final one, but we'll see. And that's it. So, drop a comment. Um, are you excited for Bash in Berlin? Bad Blood? NXT No Mercy? Holy shit, man. It's fantastic. Drop a comment. Are you excited for all that? And are you excited for Moon Knight and Insidious 6? Love you guys. Peace out.